Hello and welcome back to our continuation of the Let's Defend platform exercises. Today we're going to tackle the medium severity alert dated January 1, 2021, 6 11 p.m. It is a SOC 103 malicious APK detected with an event ID of 37. As per the normal process, I am going to go ahead and copy everything that is presented in the alert and paste it into a notepad session. Go ahead and take ownership. Okay, so we are dealing with detection for a malicious Got no traffic in any of the log stuff. Okay, so let's go ahead and take the package name com.makinggames.worldtv and we will dump it into kudos. Kados? I don't know how it's pronounced. Only get f four entries. All of them is, well, okay. Detected in red. Corrupted. Adware, adware. Those are 2018, 2018, 2018. Last one that shows up is 2019. And these are all given negative votes. So, pretty good indicator that this stuff is bad. But, we are given a piece of, well, the possible puzzle as we don't have an MD5 from the actual detection itself. One thing I didn't look at, endpoint, is the Lily phone in the agents list. It is not. Okay, so that's going to be a uh, dry hole. But okay. So we take. Uh, Kudos, Kodos, Komatos. <laughs> we take the uh, hashes that were given. These look like SHA-256. And we're going to dump them into virus total and see what shakes out. So 62F4. 62F4, okay. And... 24 out of 62. Trojan, 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 Adware. Definitely not. Well, I don't know if I'd really consider Adware malicious, but definitely unwanted. But we've got a few Trojan hits. Okay, and then we will grab the other one. Next one in series, working from top to bottom. 03122. And again, unwanted, riskware, trojan, malware, adware, but 27 out of 63. All right, so let's grab CDD9 and submit that to virus total. And we have grayware, adware, malicious, trojan, riskware, malware, trojan. Okay, yeah, 26 out of 62. And then for our last one, EBEB. EB. Again, submitted the virus total. And uh, more of the same. Adware, Trojan, Malware, Riskware. All bad stuff that we don't want to see. So, let's go ahead and take this and... See if we get any search results inside of hybrid analysis, as I believe. Oh, we got a few. Up until submit or September. That basically reported as hidden ad. Okay, let me go ahead and duplicate this. We'll submit the next one in series. Uh, as per normal process. I will take the 
links and everything and put them in the notes section of the video description. Alright, so the only thing we have is just these two entries here. Well, as of 2019, but enough that I would think that this is uh, definitely risen to the bar of just being able to call it malicious. So, let's go ahead and start the playbook. Did a log man or searched in log management. We didn't find anything for the source address. And I don't suppose out of either of these, they gave us a URL or an IP address or anything along those lines. I'm not really seeing. I think generally in hybrid analysis, it's underneath this portion, I believe, where the network information would be, if it tried network comms. No. So it's a report that just basically goes back to this. Okay. So we don't have anything. Having run through this stuff, I'm just going to call it malicious because we've got enough AV detections. We don't have any indication of actual network connections. So theoretically what we're left with is we are not able to ascertain which version. We're just going to cover our bases. And we're just going to grab the four MD5s. We'll go back to Kudos. And we're going to use just that as the reference point for the dates. We'll go back over. We'll grab the next one in series. Grab the MD5. Drop it in. Go back to Kudos. Time and date, third one in sequence, grab the MD5, so we're just going to rinse and repeat. And our last MD5. Since again, we're doing this just because of the fact that we do not have any sort of hash value. All we were given was the package name. So these are the only hash values that we can come up with. So we might as well put them on a watch list and or block list. And unfortunately, there is no containment. Vice is not listed. Really? Oh, the playbook's messed up. Let's get it in here twice. We'll try it again. If that does not work, then I will pause this recording. I really don't want to have to make a two-part video. Or I'll just basically push it through and just alert them. K 
can't do containment because it's not there. And once again, no playbook entry. So what's going to happen is there's going to be a cut. I am going to pause this. I am going to reach out to let's defend to see as to whether or not I have them work their magic on the back end to fix the bug. And then hopefully should be able to restart the video with just no interruption.